The examination of the posterior chest is often the primary focus of an OSCE. During closer inspection, you may more clearly see skeletal abnormalities, scars, asymmetry of chest wall movements, or the swelling of subcutaneous emphysema. Okay. Uh, are you in any pain, Darren? No. Okay. This assesses for any rib trauma. If there is a fracture or bruise, the pain localizes to the affected area. If already done as part of examination of the anterior chest, it is not necessary to repeat here. This assesses symmetry of chest wall movement. Okay. Uh, again. This assesses chest expansion. All the way out. Thumbs should move symmetrically and normal expansion All is at least out. five centimeters. Your thumbs must meet at the moment of full expiration for an accurate assessment of chest expansion. Can I get you to put your arms around uh, yourself as if you're hugging yourself? Okay, uh, can you repeat after me? Blue balloons. This Blue rotates balloons. the scapulae out of the way. Blue balloons. Blue this balloons. assesses tactile fremitus. Blue Position the side of your Blue hand balloons. in the intercostal spaces to maximize Blue sensitivity. Balloons. Fremitus Blue is increased over consolidation, Blue lower balloons. collapse or solid masses. Blue it is decreased over effusion. Blue balloons. Blue balloons. Blue balloons. Blue balloons. Blue balloons. Thank you. Right. So Darren, now I'm going to tap uh, again on your back. Percuss the posterior chest, starting with the supraclavicular fossa over the apex of the lung. Next, percuss the clavicles directly. Percuss in an S-shaped pattern, which compares left to right and upper zones to lower zones. If you have not already done so when examining the anterior chest, percuss two areas in the axillae. to your breathing. So can you take some deep breaths in and out through your mouth please. Start by listening over the apices with the bell. Switch over to the diaphragm. Move in an S-shaped pattern so that right is compared to left and upper compared to lower regions. Listen over the same areas you percussed. The apices four to five areas down the chest and two areas in the axillae. When presenting your findings on auscultation, are breath sounds present, reduced or absent? Specify where the changes occur. Are they normal vesicular or bronchial? And are there any added sounds such as wheeze, crackles or rubs? Remember your anatomy. Do not listen over the spine or over the scapulae. Listen over the same areas Thank for you. vocal resonance. And can I get you to repeat blue balloons? Uh, every time I move my chest. Go. Blue balloons. 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 Blue balloons, blue balloons, blue balloons, blue balloons. Yeah, thank you.